Hey everyone, Kaban Rani, 456 here, continuing my Let's Play on uh, Slime and the Black Knight. So last time we did, uh, we went to Molten Mine, did some extra missions in other worlds, and uh, went against Sir Percival. So now we have the option actually to go to Faraway Avalon, but um, I'm not going to just yet. We're going to do some extra missions uh, in these other stages, so um, I guess I'll go to uh, Camelot Castle right here. Now, um, as you see right here, I already did some of the extra stages. That's because this is my second take of recording this, so... Yeah, basically the stage here that uh, was unlocked is uh, Go For The Goal, so we're gonna try this again. Um, reason why I started re-recording was because uh, I was kind of failing a bit and uh, had some problems with uh, some gameplay, so... But, um, I actually think I may have gotten my brightness off, but I'm not too sure though. But anyway, look here. We can now change our style. So we have here um, Knight Style, which is basically a balanced style of gameplay. We have here Cavalier Style, which is speed oriented. And we have Attack Oriented Paladin Style. So um, Cavalier, if you get that, you will be blazing through the stages so fast. Like if you fully upgrade Cavalier, it's not even funny. Like it's so fast, it's like almost uncontrollable, mind blowing fast. And it gives you attacks so that you can just slice through enemies to so keep going, keep maintaining your speed. It's pretty awesome. Well, Paladin, you kind of have better guard and stuff like that. So, anyway, we're just going to hop in right now. And, uh, yeah, I really do think I got my brightness off. Um, let me check and see. After this, uh, yeah, I did. Be right back. Okay, I think that's better now. So, we're going to go for it now. Skadoosh! So, uh, yeah, hopefully my gameplay will be better right here instead of, uh, like in my last video. Gosh, my gameplay was terrible in the last video. Take this, you sons of guns. My gosh. And he chopped me from behind. What a cheap son of a whore. Haven't you heard about being a knight? You don't chop from him from the back. You face him like a man. Huh. Well, we took... Oh my gosh, that thing just boosted me right into him. How cheap is that? Alright, so here we are flying off. Doing well so far, I guess. Besides getting hit a couple of times, but it wasn't my fault. So, thank you. Okay, whatever. Hey, take this. No! You see that? Stupid. Oh my gosh. It was acting all weird right there. So yeah. I kind of have a bit of rage from the last stage. Like the last video. So I was getting all ticked off. And oh my gosh. Stupid woggly. Controls not working. Yeah, because I was getting really pissed off in the last video. It was just like craziness. This game was acting pretty stupid. I don't know why. Like... Okay, well, I didn't even press anything, but I just did instant, like, slam into him. Alright. Take this, you sons of guns. Alright. There we go, nice. <laughs> what the heck's that? Alright. Whoa, man, holy flippin' mackerel. You just like chopped through all of those. Dude's like, piece of cake. <laughs> this is like, fool, take careful aim. Ball. Frickin' ball. Okay, so slide to the right, left. <laughs> I need to learn my left and right again, I guess. <laughs> I almost said right. There we go. How do you like that? I'm gonna chop. Dang you! Okay, they're gonna fire at that. Alright. Chop through them. Thank you. Goodbye. Freaking tool. What? Ugh. Alright. <laughs> Take that. Take that. Goodbye. Alright, so come right here. Wee! Okay, now it's pretty weird right here. If you come down, 
basically you have a chance of like giving this person okay the person is supposed to be free to talk to but for some reason she won't talk to me i have no idea why it happened last video too when i was recording my first tape of this it's weird but um anyway let's chop some dudes into chop suey Alright. Whee! Look at this go! Okay, let's speed this up a bit. Okay. Yeah, just... Just chop through these idiots. Suck! You suck, man! Oh my gosh, just chopping at me. But anyway, we're through. Well, two stars. Oh my gosh, whatever. <laughs> I thought I was going to get through, like, at least three stars or something, but no. Oh well. Whoa! We got a ton of stuff here. I think that's a raven's feather, to be honest. But there isn't anything too impressive here, though. Yep, raven's feather. Bronze longsword. Bronze helmet. And we hardly have any more, so I think I'll go for uh, these. Yeah. Alright. Now we're gonna go on to, uh, let me think. I think that was the first stage we did right there? Yeah, in this video. Now we're gonna go to uh, Crystal Cave, and we're going to do uh, the stage that they had unlocked a few moments ago, Rush Hour. So you gotta make sure you don't run into any of the townspeople or else you fail the, fail the mission. So just make sure you don't do that. Yep. Like them. Okay, for some reason it keeps looking like my focus is off in this video, but I'm not too sure. Let me see. I think it may be fine. If it is a bit off, then I don't, it's not really too bad from what I see, so. Chop them. Okay. Yeah, it looks fine. It's not too bad. Okay. Keep running forward. Dodge them. Dow! Oh! You tool! That's what I don't like about this mission. Basically, they the people appear at the last second almost. Basically, best thing to do is just stay in the air, but still, it's unacceptable for them to be popping up at the last second to where you can hardly dodge them at times. That makes sense. At least you have the slam move. Oh gosh. Alright, here we go. Just dodge him. No! See here, stuh! I guess I'll hold back for now. Man. Gotta chill. What? Oh, dang it, I accidentally did that. Well, we got some stuff right here. Dang it, I accidentally hit the rock salt. Oh, well. Let's try this again. So, I kind of don't under, like, like, I kind of don't know why they have the townspeople appear at the last second. I really think it's pretty cheap in some ways. Like, like I was saying before, the game has some really good missions at times, but then a lot of them are just a bunch of bull crap like this. I guess I'll hold back They're just now. utter poop. All I gotta do is steer clear of the townspeople. I'm just trying to do some of the missions right here to actually extend this LP a bit, because, uh... I could basically finish it right now if I wanted to in this video, but, um, yeah. Dang you. Go to heck. Guess I'll hold back for now. Can't believe this. I did on my second try in my previous part. It's ridiculous. It's all acting weird now because the game... Uh, Can I chop these people? I want to kill them. I want to kill them. I seriously want to kill them. Kill you. You suck. Yeah, there we go. Chop, 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 chop. Come near me and you shall pay. See here? Yeah. Yeah. That's what I'm talking about. Uh-huh, yeah. 
Ouch! Come near me and you shall pay. Dang you. I guess I'll hold back for now. <sighs> it was actually working for a second. Working better than before, but uh, still screwed me over. Look at that. They just pop up out of nowhere. Like, oh gosh. Freaking stupid. Hey, jump over him. I don't give a crap. Okay. Okay. They're gonna have a treasure chest trust here to fool you, basically. Oh, lovely. Chop him in the crotch, cause that's the best way to kill an enemy. Oh man, the goal is right there. There we go, nice. Finally did it. Ugh. Alright, so uh, let's see what we've unlocked here. Moonstone, Tome of Jewels, oh nice. And we can't unlock that, alright. So now, we're going to go on to the stage in a Titanic plane. And that was Rampage. Defeat 60 enemies, so let's do this. Now, uh, it's probably, let me think. Oh yeah, this level, it's kind of, it's kind of, you can kind of get yourself hurt a lot, so. Be careful. Oh man. Chop you in the crotch. Okay, now watch out for these long dudes. Dang it to heck. You're gonna take a full power attack at your face. I'm gonna make you all unrecognizable. See there? Chop you in the crotch. Ah, come on, thank you. Alright. Okay, there's a person right here you can talk to. Even though that last... I really did don't want to talk to some of these people after that last stage. Ticked me off big time. Okay. What? Shenanigans. Shenanigans. Sh freaking, freaking shenanigans. You see why I don't like some of the stages with the Waka Waka Sword Sword attack? Huh. Because when you just, when you have to woggle it in a game, sometimes it just doesn't pick up your sword attacks. Take that. Alright. This dude's... These big dudes are like the easiest enemies to go against. All they do is just... Get in your way, basically. Alright. What?! Oh my gosh. I'm gonna chop you in the crotch as many times as I have to. Yeah, right in the balls. Heck yeah. Did you see that? I poked him right in him. Alright. Two stars again. Lovely. Absolutely freaking lovely. So we got a ton of items here, though. A steel longsword. Uh, I don't want to unlock the rest of that stuff. Toma plants. Troll's eyelash. And carnation. Lovely. So, the last stage is the incredibly terrible, terrible grind challenge. So, this is rage inducing. This stage is, oh my gosh. In the previous take, I had done this stage probably around 20 times. That's no joke. I'm probably actually um, like under, like telling you, like I actually probably did it more times than that to be honest. The stage sucks. It sucks, Sega. Why did you put this in the game, Sega? At least give it some proper controls. See there? If you don't land on the ground, it basically now. means instant loss, and I accidentally pressed the A button. Dag nabbit. Well, we got a stone, some flintstone, and an amethyst, so I guess it wasn't a full loss. But we're gonna try this again here. Gosh, I hate this stage. 
Alright. Trying to still be a bit optimistic right here, right now. But, it's ridiculous. Okay. Late jump. Late jump. Okay, there we go. Okay, here we go. Finally! Thank you, God! Thank you, God! Hallelujah! At least I got a good ranking. My gosh. My flipping gosh, I never thought I was gonna get it, to be honest. I thought the game was just gonna screw me over and be like, giving me a middle finger the whole time. Alright, so we beat it. And, uh, now we never have to go to that stage again. So! Now we can go to Faraway Avalon. The first... Uh, yeah, I think that's it, actually. Yeah, I don't have to do anything else. Never mind, then. Let's just start. Yes! Time to take down King Arthur. Yes, yes, yes. I'm Sonic the Hedgehog, Knight of the Wind. Let's settle this once and for all, King Arthur. It seems your impersonation of a knight has improved. Then let us have another look at that unsightly sword. You're gonna be sorry you asked. This is it, old pal. No, 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 no. Then bring it on, King Arthur. Let's do this. Let's do it to it. Sonic always says. So. Defeat the boss, King Arthur. Let's so yeah. not look at it right there, but um, anyway, this is a pretty awesome boss fight, just to let y'all know. And the music is incredible. Listen to it. Oh, nice. Crush 40 is amazing. They know how to make Sonic music. They just know how to make music overall. Okay, so hit his tail right there. And... Follow the prompts right here. Sometimes they're very, very wrong. They don't let you know when you're supposed to hit them, but uh, just keep chopping at them. And uh, yeah, you can actually take them out in one try if you know how to do the perfect hits just right. But sadly, I do not. So that's why I didn't. Oh, dang, man, it paralyzed me. What a douche. Okay. Okay. Here we go. Take him again. All right, concentrate. Dang it! Okay, stand right in the middle of that. All right, here we go. Watch for the prompts. I'm kind of doing it a bit too early. Dang it! It's that last hit that always gets me. The last hit. I'm just trying to remember how to do it right. Because there's a way to do it easily so that you don't get hit or anything. Okay. Hey there. Alright, here we go. Let's try this again. Let's try this again. No, 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 I missed it. I didn't know there was another hit. Dag nabbit. Oh, gosh. I'm doing terrible here. Okay. Dang it. Alright. Seriously, I'm just gonna hit him from behind again. Alright, let's try this again. Okay. Here we go. Yes! Oh, yeah! Woo. There we go. So yeah, it's like one slow, then you hit it again, it's gonna delay, then you hit it instantly like again. No problem. Like, look, yeah, I can't recall how it is. Seriously, I'm gonna try it again. I'm gonna retry. Hoping I can do this, cause uh, like I'm trying to see if I can get five stars here, cause uh, I know I did a long time ago on YouTube, but uh, it's been so long, like, 
Now I can't recall if I, like, I'm trying to recall the pattern to get five stars perfect here. I'm just going to try my best and uh, see how it works. Like, I want to see if I can get this duel perfectly so that, because uh, I remember I used to be able to do it, like, easily I could beat this guy perfectly. But uh, it takes a lot of practice to do, so. Watch out for the paralyzing move with these lasers. Okay. Alright. Here we go. Okay, remember the pattern, remember the pattern. Here we go, yes, we got it perfect. Yes, 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 yes. Oh my gosh. That was so challenging. Five stars, baby. That's what I'm talking about. That is how you take him out perfectly. First, you gotta do it slow. Then when he does a second strike, you hit it, and then right after that, wait a second and hit it again, even if you don't see the woggle. Then you wait for him to strike again, and then you hit it fast again, and then again, basically, if you saw that. So, man, and I know that probably sounds kind of confusing to do, but uh, if you just remember that in your head, you can easily take this guy out, and that's what I did right there. So we got, oh man, we got a ton of nice items right here. All right, so we're done here. And uh, we got some cutscenes. <laughs> I am immortal. You cannot defeat me. Oh, snap. Now, Sonic, the three sacred swords. Got it! Skadoosh. The freaking Triforce. Flipping gosh, he chopped him right in the balls. He's like, no, my manliness, my you all know. Yes, I did it. Wow, something just freaking owned King Arthur right there. Wow, so that's it. And I uh, hear the credits here, so lovely. And I love this song. Oh yeah, Jim Snowa. Whoa, 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 whoa. Oh. So uh, yeah, so like um, this game, really awesome. Really enjoyed it, and. Uh, you know, to be honest, I'm just gonna go on and say it, even though it's kinda is a spoiler right now. The game's not over yet. They're just playing these credits to kinda fool you a bit. Be like, oh yeah, it's not like God King Arthur. Yes, he's a true enemy. No, there's actually more, but anyway, here we go. On into the heat of day, hey, hey, like a knight. I'll fight, I'll fight until the fight is won. Hey, hey, in the rage. I'll save, I'll save, each and every, each and every, each and every one, every one. Woo! Love this music. Let me know what you think about the game so far. Do you think it's interesting? Uh, do you think it looks like crap? Or would it be something you're actually thinking about picking up? Like, because the game got a below average score on a Metacritic, Sega actually did remove the game new from retail stores. But you can kind of pick it up used at, uh, I think, like, Best Buy and uh, GameStop. So, if you find it there, I don't know, check it out if you're interested in it. And then there are always many copies on eBay, so... Whoa! Hey, y'all! But, uh, I did like the game. Like, I mean, it's alright. It's kind of decent, but, um, it's not something I'm gonna play a lot or anything like that. Or something I did play a lot so much. It was alright. But, um, I just had, there were some problems to where it was like s some stages would really upset you with the controls. In a rage, I'll say, each and every, each and every, each and every one, every one. For is one, hey, hey, am I meant to rule by sword? Slashing through the every inch of the power, the power in you. As I sit, as I stand. Man, 
what am I doing? I'm just singing, and y'all are probably like, okay, this is weird, this is awkward. I'm sorry, I just love this music. Oh, I love this part coming up. Here it is. The night of the wind. I'm the night of the massive force, a stronghold of power, another string. Yeah, I forgot the lyrics for this part. I'm just telling you, Crush 40 knows how to make awesome music. Like the guitar riffs and everything. Friggin' awesome. Oh yeah! Whoa! Frickin' awesome sauce! Heck oh yeah, this game is pretty cool! <laughs> oh, this part's awesome, listen to this. I just decided to be quiet for the rest of it right there, but um, yeah, the reason why I'm not giving so much of my opinions right now is because, like I said, the game is not over, so, yeah, <laughs> but um, yeah, I mean, I, there were just the credits, I kind of just wanted to go on and talk a bit about the game so far, I guess, and then uh, I sang a bit, <laughs> and uh, uh, some people were like, shut up, you just, just be quiet. I wish I could put the mute button on or something. Well, <laughs> whatever. I love this game, and, uh, you know what? I, I don't really care what too many people, like, I mean, never mind. But, anyway, yeah. So, that was it uh, for the credits right here for now. So, and uh, look right here. New background music, a new record has been set, and a new mission has been added. So... Here, I told you this game is not over, but uh, we're not gonna get into that um, in this video. Next time, we'll uh, like basically do the finale video, most likely. So um, depends on how long it is. But um, anyway, thank you all so much for watching. Hope you all enjoyed the video. Make sure to hit the like button, all that jazz. Um, thanks again. See y'all. Have a good day.